In this quick video, I want to show you how to switch from a planter to your combine on the Gen 3 monitor. So first, we'll start by going into our setup, and I want to change the equipment that we're currently running on. So changing from uh, my planter over to a combine, I'm going to select my implement type and select combine. Now, before I go any farther, I do get a pop-up here that says, are you sure you want to do this? Because it's going to overwrite what's currently being used. And if I haven't saved that information, it's gone. So I'm going to hit no, because before I lose this, I want to actually go down and save both my planter configuration and my tractor configuration. So tapping on uh, the save current planter configuration is going to let me go ahead and, and just toss in my name here, or the name of my planter. So there's Allen's 24 row. And I now have that saved and when it was last uh, saved as. Additionally, I also want my tractor because that has the GPS positioning on it. So the measurements for my globe is, that's going to be important for me to remember. And so we'll just go ahead and toss this in as well. And now I have also Alan's tractor saved. So that way, if I ever come back to this implement and I plug back in on uh, the 24 row planner and I hook back up to this specific tractor, I have that configuration readily available. Now I can go in and I can feel free to switch over to my combine. Uh, that information has already been saved on the DBM. And when I go back to my planter next spring, it'll be readily available for me. But I can now go in and start to set up what style of combine do I have, what uh, size head am I using, and again, that GPS information as well. If you have any more questions, please look at the online resources, uh, specifically the Yieldsense Operator's Guide for setting up your combine.